as always we have to get some dose of inspiration from africa's most influential youtuber wadebaya he never stops talking positively to make sure he encourages you to go on your journey successfully just like he started from a scratch and now he is where he is what did he talk about let's get to love it hi welcome to youtube creators africa bring it to news and updates about your favorite african youtuber and what's up on youtube what the buyer is the most influential youtuber in africa as he says it it is not from him but it came out from the people whom he had been meeting and the fans across the globe who had been appreciating his works that's when he had to be called the most influential youtuber in africa just a recent he won an award in ghana of the same title the most african most influential african youtuber of the year yes that one suggests that he is not wrong to call himself the most influential african youtuber in africa but one thing you should like about him is the inspiration that he gives out to the public he is never negative if you keep on watching what the buyer throughout all his videos he is a guy who is never negative when you find somewhere that is trying to be negative it is when he's giving a positive criticism over something that has to be corrected that's what he did here he had to come out to encourage everyone who are trying to run away from the haters that that is not right what did he talk about let's find out what am i tweeted if you don't have people hating on what you do my friend go to a nearby supermarket and buy one <laughs> haters help you grow it is like a funny tweet but very correct that go to the supermarket and buy one hater if you don't have any hater hating on what you do. He did stop there. There is another tweet which he brought out. Let, let's their, neg let their negative remarks be your source of drive. There you now understand why he said if you don't have people hating on what you do, go to the supermarket and buy one cause haters help you grow. Let's exhaust this according to how he tweeted it. If you have been following Wadebaya Ghana's vlogger, he has always attributed some of his success to, to negative criticism by the people. So if people criticize him, if people hate on what he's doing and try to tease him and talk a lot of hell about what he's doing, that's where he gets the moment to start out and say yes let me do it in a better way that they think because if they don't criticize what you are doing you will always think you're doing the right thing and you will never correct on where you go wrong so it is okay to have haters of what you do